Come on, make some noise. Let me feel you. What's going down, everybody? You know, at the last week, I had a hard time choosing a song for me to sing today. So I figured I'd just go ahead and tell you girls and guys a story about my younger days when I was coming up as a singer. See, I'm from New York City, and we used to ride the train. Up New York, that's what I'm talking about. I, and we used to ride the train, and one day I'm going to school and I see this girl standing right there at 125th Street catching a fall train. You feel what I'm saying? And she's sitting there, she's looking all pretty and stuff. And I'm, I'm shy, so I was like, you know, I'm just looking at her from a distance from the other side because I was going uptown, she was going downtown. You feel me? So, and there was this guy, and he was just smooth as a cucumber, you know, and he was a uh, Light scan, light scan brother. And he called coming. There'll be three knocks at the door, my baby. Trench coat hits the floor, my baby. So he's moving, I'm watching him from across the hall. And I'm like, damn. So the next day, because you know in New York, when you take the train, you see the same people every day. So I see her, and I'm like, all right, I'm gonna try this, I'm gonna try this. And I start shooting a Cisco note. And I go, yeah, yeah. And she looked at me, she like, mm-hmm. <laughs> nah, bro, that ain't gonna work. That ain't gonna work. So, so I, got, I, I figured out a way to go, well, maybe I could just tone it down a little bit. You know, so the next day I came to the same girl and I said, last night. You feel, you feel what I'm telling you? You know that song right there? Last night. I watched you and she, she just looked at me funny. So DJ hit that song. So I said, okay, that's not worth it. So I just sang this song right here. I said, baby, you gonna feel this or you not? You feel me? So if you know this song, I want you to help me and sing it to the person next to you. Or hold your phone next to the speaker and go, baby.
can we have Denise Patterson first, please? Just keeping in mind with when you say you want to see the for the military, um, right now they're still taking auditions for the soldier show because you have the energy, um, you got to be able to sing and move at the same time. So um, just to heads up that they're still taking auditions right now. Um, <laughs> one thing that I would encourage you to do though is even when you're in character, don't over sync your notes. Um, you break my control when you get to the higher ones. We're still able to hear you, so break my my control there. Just when you get your note that you're not sure instead of running from it and over singing, attack the note. And then uh, the last thing, don't let your props be a distraction. If they don't open, move to something else. <laughs> I tried. That punch just didn't want to come open, and I was hot as jail too. I was like, oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Colonel Lane, please. Great performance. Uh, I stand corrected. Uh, I think you uh, you definitely topped on the showmanship here uh, for the night. Uh, we run through a range, and I wrote you in as a higher number, so uh, you were definitely the best at that. You, you grabbed the audience from the beginning. I, I would echo also the, the other thing that the Soldier Show uh, counts on is your ability to interact with people, uh, and you've got that. You can reach out and grab an audience and keep them going and kind of carry us along the tail. Uh, and put, put some music, uh, some very good music in the middle, uh, which is uh, a great quality for a performer. So I, I was very entertained again. Great performance. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Oh, thank you. And then, so uh, last thing, let's go to Mr. Rusty Burns, please. You know, I was always told when you go on a stage, you're going to act like you own the place. And believe me, you do. You do. You have showmanship 100%. Outstanding. Wow. So great job. Sweet Thank you. potatoes. Fantastic job. Great job. We'll see you again. Thank you all. Another round of applause for Mr. Christian Ortiz, please.